We're going to go kind of, first of all with this, we're going to give ourselves permission to fail, right? So even after we do this a few times, if you're not quite getting it, I don't want you to worry about it. I don't want you to worry about it. Um, or start making corrective actions so that you're successful. I just want you to play with this. And we're going to go super slow. And so I've got the head and arm. I'm always doing the head and arm so my balls are touching. I don't want to be sat on the floor um, just because I don't want to be doing that. It's not reality. And Matt's going to take his, I'll just, for the sake of what I'm talking, I'll sit on the floor. But yeah, so he's got this one arm connection. Get your connection as good as you want it, Matt. Yeah. And like, so he's going to just work on doing that. So I'm here, I'm, I'm putting the weight on him and, and whatever, right? And he, he, he goes for, he just takes his time getting himself into position and he does his bridge as and when he feels ready. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Back over. Yeah. So, and what you'll find is that like the tighter that I am here, the, the easier it kind of is a little bit to roll him. So go again, Matt. I'm going to feel that connection. I'm feeling where he is. Shut your eyes. He's shutting his eyes. Feeling where that is. So I'm getting used to, yeah, I'm just getting used to feeling where all this is. And then what Henry was playing with was basically, um, he was letting the guy then put his arms together. But this kind of idea, yes, yeah, so put both your hands together. Yeah. And I now want you just to, uh, just to roll me down there. And so what starts to happen is, as you actually relax and just change his connection a little bit, so you're feeling, you're trying to feel where is he connecting to me to get your grip, and, and the tighter he goes, it's like it's even better when he goes tight. Because I can feel right now it's kind of about here. So as, as Max goes to uh, roll me, don't I? You feel it's off. <laughs> So all I'm doing is I'm taking, like, he was connecting right up in my armpit, yeah, and all I'm starting to do is just kind of relax my shoulder back to let it kind of drop a bit. And so now it changes the whole orientation of where he's trying to connect, yeah. So as he, so now it feels like the connection to me has gone back down, the closest connection he's got is down, down at the hip, yeah. As I start doing this to him when I go tight, you know, maybe the connection's at the elbow or whatever, um, sorry, my connection with the elbow, he's feeling, but like I'm trying to feel where's his connection. Yeah, so as he goes to do the move and he tightens up, I'm going to try and feel where that is. Yeah, go on, bro. Yeah, and it feels like I just want to start. Now, Henry's is a lot subtler than what I'm doing. I don't have that level yet, but you're just trying to feel where it is and you're just trying to take it away. Because if they can't transfer through that part of the body, you're just being all like awkward. But it's not like a big, I'm not trying to make a big movement with it. I'm just trying to feel that oh, it feels like it's more like a sprawl. I, I did a bit too big a movement. But when you're watching Henry do it, he's literally like just, just relaxing. He seems like he's just flopping his upper body. So every time that he's in this position and he feels Matt go to go, he's feeling where it is and it's like, okay. So I'm going to still stay tight. I'm still relaxed. I'm not giving everything up, but I'm just letting everything kind of go a little bit. So yeah, now bridge me, Matt. It should feel like it's just not on. It's weird. You set, yeah, everything feels right, like to begin with, and then as you go, as you go, go it, it's just not there. It just isn't quite. The time it's not most on is when you tense up. Yeah. When I'm tense, it's really easy. When I'm rigid, it's really easy to move me when I'm like this, when I'm trying to win. It's really easy to move me. But when, when I, if I can relax a little bit, relaxing doesn't mean I let go of his tricep. It doesn't mean I don't have every intention of trying to keep this close enough that it's touching my balls. I don't like let the, I don't let it go. I just take the tension out of my body. And I might just change the uh, little subtle shit just to mean that as he bridges, now he's not really connected with that arm. Yeah. So let's just do the drill again with the, let's just do it with one arm to begin with. Uh, on there, and you're just trying to, you're letting them do it. Let them get it a couple of times. Make sure it's on. And then on the third time, just tweak it a little bit. Yeah, and then you hold it down the top. Are you keeping your weight through it? You're not setting up. Yeah, I don't want to sit on the ground, really. I mean, that might happen sometimes. Yeah. Um, 
But what I'm really trying to do is just relax. I still want the weight on them, ideally. Um, it might happen. But it's more just trying to relax on the connection. You're trying to sort of disconnect through relaxation. For the guy on top, is this going back to like what we're doing the other day? You're pulling yourself down a little bit as well. Or is this different? Where you what? Where you're pulling yourself down. Remember when we were doing the side control, where you're sort of riding and you usually just pull yourself down. And you're trying yeah, to yeah. Oh, yeah, well, that's another kind of example of it. Right? Same thing. idea, yeah. yeah. Yeah, subtle shift, very small, can't be seen, mm -hmm. but it disconnects. Yeah.